In today's NX Cam Tech Tip, we're going to be covering how to convert a tool library from an older NX version to a newer NX version. In this example, we're using NX 2212, and I've just upgraded to NX 2312. So if I see my tool library here, retrieve tools from library, endmill, you'll see I do have some custom tools already defined. Now, if I quickly change to NX2312, and I want to program the same part, go to Create Tool, Retrieve Tools from Library, find an end mill, you'll see I do not have my custom tools. So what I can do to automate this process is go to the Menu, Tools dropdown, and find the Convert Tool Library command. I'm prompted to then find the database or the .dat file for my previous tool library. So you can see I have NX 2212 installed. Navigate to Mock, Resource, Library, Tool, and for this example, I'm going to use the metric database. So for this convert tool, all I have to do is actually just select the tool underscore database dot .dat. Everything else will automatically be converted. Click OK and you'll see the blue spinner will go for a couple minutes depending how large your tool library is. Now that the conversion tool is done, I'm going to navigate to the Create Tool dialog, Retrieve Tools from Library, Milling, End Mill, click OK, and now you'll see I actually have all of my same tools from the, my NX2212, now in my NX2312. Navigating back to my NX2312 local install in the resource, library, tool, and metric database, you'll see backups have been created of the original installation of NX. So in case anything happens, you can always go back to a backup. And this occurs every time that you do an update to your tool library via the conversion tool. If in the initial version of NX that you created your tool, you also exported a tool part file that was associated with your library reference, this is not automatically brought into the new version of NX. In this case, what you must do is you must navigate to the original version which you are converting from. In my case, NX2212, and you'll see there's a graphics folder here. So all these tools are actually custom tools that I specified. Now what I want to do is copy these from this folder and into my new NX2312 graphics folder, I'm simply going to paste them inside. Okay, so now when I go to create one of those tools, retrieve this tool from the library, in this case it's a drill, and I preview my tool, You'll also see I now have the tool graphics associated with that part file. Additionally, enhancements have been made to the Cloud Connect Tool Manager first introduced in NX2306. In the latest release of NX2312, we also now have the ability to visualize our tool assemblies. Now that we've imported our tool library from a previous NX version, using the Import Existing Assembly Data option. We now convert all of our previous tool assemblies to new tool assemblies using the Cloud Connect Tool Manager. So for example, if I want to edit my tool assembly, you can see I now have a new user interface to do so, all using my previously defined tool database from NX2312.